have an intro as usual, but today I'm doing a bright, like a spring look. So I did my eyebrows off camera as usual. And for eyeshadow right now, I'm using the NYX palette and I'm going in with that bright yellow shade and applying it all over my crease area. <music> And I'm just blending away and now I'm taking the orange shades in the palette and applying that below the yellow with the same Morphe M14 brush into the crease and blending it out and then for the outer corner I'm taking this briery bright pink shade and packing it on the NYX palette isn't that pigmented so as you can see right now I'm going in with the Morphe palette which as you can see the pink is so much more pigmented so I am using this pink shade in the outer corner and I'm also taking some of the orangey shades in the palette and building up the orange crease, crease shade because it wasn't as good as it could be and I'm also building up the yellow shade because they weren't as bright as they could be. So I just basically kept building on everything to make it look as seamless and as blended as possible. So I just keep going back with the pink shade and then I un like wiped off the other eye and I reprimed it with primer and I put concealer over it so it can be like a fresh base so I just wanted to show me doing this cuz so basically this same video is going on Instagram and it's gonna be up the same time as this one video is gonna go live so if you guys want to see the products I looked go check that out and to cut my crease I used the elf concealer and in like where I cut it I put a little bit of the yellow shade right next to the pink and then I put a whole bunch of glitters in the inner corner so the first one was the Stila liquid eyeshadow um, this one was in the shade Wanderlust so I applied this shade first and after I applied this shade I used it kind of as a glitter glue and I went in with the NYX glitter in the shade GLI excuse me 10 so I did that and then I did the other eye off camera as usual and I'm going on my face for moisturizer I'm using the pods nourishing moisturizer this is the tiny travel size and I look weird right here because my back was hurting so I leaned back in my chair and then for primer I'm using the Smashbox primerizer and the Huda Beauty um, complexion perfection pre makeup base so the primerizer I used all over my face because my face is dry and then the Huda primer I used in my nose and my chin like where I have the most pores so that's where I use that just helps like make my makeup look better <laughs> For foundation, I used the Marc Jacobs Remarkable Foundation and the L'Oreal um, Fresh Wear Foundation. So the one from Marc Jacobs is in the shade 10, 12 Ivory, and then the one from L'Oreal is in 400. And I applied both of these, and the sound, if my sound was on, the sound that it was making when I did this, I was literally beating my face. Like, I was dying laughing um, editing this video. Because the sound was literally so funny. I was literally trying to hurry because I had to go to something after this. So I was beating my face. So yeah. I just applied this all over. And it took me a little bit of time. Because I kept running out of the L'Oreal once. So I had to keep adding more. And I only added a little bit of Marc Jacobs. Because it's really full coverage. And the shade is very dark for me. But I just wanted something to mix in with the L'Oreal one. Because I don't love the L'Oreal one by itself. This foundation combination was really nice, so yeah. And then for concealer, I used the e.l.f. Camel Concealer in Fair Warm, and then I applied that to my original spots, my under eyes, my nose, my, my lip area, my forehead, and my chin. And I just blended those all in. Ha! <laughs> Here's the mother fucking... I'm sorry I'm obsessed with the, that girl so after I do that I'm setting my face and I use the Aerospun loose powder but I didn't like show it but to set the rest of my face I'm using the Estee Lauder Lucidity powder and I pat my neck to make sure as you can see right now 
make sure it's not tacky and that it's set so the makeup transfer transfers and for the under eye I just use this orange shade to just complete the eye look it's that simple and then for bronzer I use the Urban Decay Naked the Urban Decay bronzer each bronzer and bronzed and I just applied this all over my face <music> And the nose contour looks hella crazy right here, but I really blend it off after. This is like a blending brush, like I couldn't find my other brush, so I just use this brush. And then I contoured out that spot with like powder. And then for blush, I'm using the Becca blush in Flower Child, and I'm applying this all over. I looked really blushy this day, but I toned it down later on. I was like, oh my gosh. And then the second blush I used with the Too Faced Pop and Old Peach Blush. And I see my blush looks just a little bit crazy. Just a little bit. So after that, I brushed away all the powder. And also took my powder brush and went over my chin because it looks too crazy. And over my cheeks just to dye down the color because it was like, whoa, it was too crazy. And then for highlighter, my favorite highlighter right now is the ColourPop highlighter. And I actually dropped it. So I'm using this. This is in the color Flexitarian. And I'm applying this all over. It's the best highlighter. And then to my cheeks, my Cupid's bow, my nose. And I couldn't find my precise brush, so I just used the brush I usually use for highlighter. So I applied it to the bridge of my nose, the tip of my nose. And again, I couldn't find my little brush that I used, so I used my finger to get my inner corner and my brow bone. So I literally don't know where the brush went. But so that's what I did for that. And then for mascara, I use the Essence Lash Princess Mascara. This is my favorite one. This is a false lash effect one. And I really applied, like, I don't apply too much mascara. It kind of looks like I do. But if I applied more of my lashes, it would be huge. But I just apply a decent amount to my top and lower lashes. After I do that for lips, I use two lipsticks. The first is the Pure Lipstick in Stripped. And the second is the Too Faced Naked Dolly Lipstick. So first, I applied the... The, the one for pure cosmetics this is my favorite lipstick I use it all the time it's like a pretty good nude shade and then I wanted a little bit more of a pinky nude so I applied a little bit of the Too Faced one which had like kind of a glossy look and then I wanted more gloss so I added my Fenty gloss in Fussy this is the pink one I love this gloss I literally can't do my makeup without a gloss so that's what I used and for setting spray I used the Anastasia Beverly Hills dewy set this stuff is amazing I just applied this all over my face and let it dry. So this is the finished look. If you guys like it, give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you guys aren't already. Go check out the, the Instagram video. I love you guys so much. Goodbye.